So as we've done all week, it's time to unveil our first surprise guest of the night. I don't know who any of the guests are the last three days. It's been an awesome, awesome ride to see who they are. So let's see who guest number one is tonight here on Unfiltered. And we welcome in our surprise, my guy, Eddie Olchek. <laughs> Enzo! I texted you today and said, hey, it's my last day on TV. And you gave me that. <laughs> really? I didn't know. Yeah. Well, uh, Cap, uh, for as much as I'd like to bust your chops, uh, it is a uh, honor and privilege to be on your final show. And uh, a tip of the hockey helmet to you and your family. And uh, I know how important to uh, all the people at NBC Sports Chicago and go back to the days of Comcast, the, your team, your staff, all those people uh, made made your shows go. And uh, yeah, you were the captain and leader, but uh, I know how important those people are to you and uh, proud to have been on uh, a few of your shows. You're what, 4,300? Are you sure about that? I don't know. I, I don't know if you're giving it the old Freddie Flintstone counting there, but uh, sounds like it's a lot. But uh, I just wanted to... Uh, be a part of this last show and I, I appreciate Duff for calling me and uh, asking me if I'd be available and uh, 110%. So I love you. Congratulations. Uh, you've done it one way and uh, you've been all in and I uh, couldn't be more proud of you and uh, just, just happy for you and your family and uh, better days ahead, right? Look ahead and be proud of what you did because you did it uh, as well as anybody. So congratulations. And so you know how much I love you. We've been through a lot together. Some great things, and there were some tough moments in both our lives, uh, but we've been side by side for those. And people have asked me a lot, when did you meet Eddie Olchek? Was it when you just got to NBC slash Comcast Sportsnet? And I said, actually, no. He was just drafted by the Blackhawks at 18 years of age. I was standing down near the finish line at Arlington Park. I'm cheering a horse in, and I go, are you Eddie Olchek? I am. <laughs> and that was the first time I met him, and here we are still gambling on horses all these many years later, and you become one of the closest people in my life. So uh, I couldn't be more honored that you're on and more proud of the type of person uh, that you are, Edzo. You're amazing. Well, it's been an amazing 38 years, Cap, and especially over the course of, uh, you know, the last, I guess, 15 years, so to speak. Uh, I love you. Um, I mean, there's obviously an emptiness uh, for the city of Chicago and all of your great fans and for your friends, but uh, understanding the world that we're living in and uh, just to let you know that uh, couldn't be more proud of you and all of the Edzos, all of the old checks, uh, give you a big hug and uh, send you off uh, on your way the way that we know you are going to go out. So uh, congratulations, Cap. Uh, enjoy the last show. And again, couldn't be more proud of the job that you've done. And uh, you carried Chicago sports on your back on TV for a lot of years. Some of it I didn't agree with. Some flipping by you over the years. But at the end of the day. Me flip? Uh, yeah, yeah, exactly. So uh, I do have to say, you do look pretty darn good tonight, by the way. So you look good. I appreciate it. And so I, I do have to ask you because I don't get to see you as much as I have. We text and talk almost every day. How is life for Eddie Olchek? You're in Seattle. You're flying around the country. How yeah. are you? Yeah, good. I mean, it's it's been uh, obviously an adventurous move. I mean, I miss I miss home. Uh, I miss the Blackhawks for sure. I always will. Uh, but I've been back a couple of times, obviously being a part of the Marion Hossa jersey retirement and a couple of games when doing for national for TNT or when the Kraken were in town. Um, but, uh, you know, it's been, you know, it's been a challenge, but it's been great. Uh, the people in Seattle have been great to me and my family and getting a chance to work with Nick, obviously my son, uh, you know, on a lot of the nights there in Seattle. So, um, but it's, uh, you know, home, home is here and, uh, um, uh, it's always nice to be home, especially around the holidays, but, uh, you know, it's, it's, uh, change is never easy for anybody. And as you will see shortly, buddy, you're going to have a lot, you're going to have a lot more free time <laughs> than you realize, but I know you'll enjoy it with Mindy and the, and the boys. And, uh, yeah, it's, it's been, uh, it's been good, but again, I miss home. I miss the Blackhawks, but, uh, you know, life isn't easy and you forge ahead and, uh, but this will always be home. That's for sure. Edzo, you're the guy that's always texting me, hey, fairgrounds, fifth race, goes in 15 <laughs> minutes. I'm going to have a lot more time to be playing the ponies over in my club Hawthorne app. So 
You may be yeah. getting some texts from me with a few pointers or a few thoughts in the horse that's racing the, game. That's okay. Look at it. We got FanDuel TV over on NBC Sports Chicago Plus for like five or six hours a day. Can you have Kevin Cross, uh, your, 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 your boss right now, but not your boss for long? Can you have him maybe extend those hours a little bit? Because when it comes in at HD, it's, it's looking awfully good. So yeah, we're, uh, we'll be texting a lot and we'll be sending a few, uh, we'll be sending a few winners your way. Edzo, my very best to your family. You know what I think of your boys and your beautiful wife and your daughter. Uh, again, I couldn't be more honored that you took time to come on today, and you know how much I adore you and love you. Love you, Cap. Love you, man. Proud of you. Let Thanks. You go. Appreciate you, Edzo. Have a great night. Thanks a lot. We've.